I like it. You, you, you like my butthole? You know what? Let's not talk about butt. Let's not open with buttholes. But have you ever <laughs> heard of to. a Barbie butt? Yeah. Bobby? I've a- heard of an American girl butt. Okay, well, let's compare the two. <laughs> no, from the American Girl store. Oh, my God. <laughs> Those you, ones. You mean doll? Doll, the doll, yeah, yeah. Doll butts. I pulled them down once. They have no butt. Yeah. Okay, same thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's exactly I go to the American Girl, girl went to the store. store. I pulled down little trousers. There's yeah. no butt. Well, that's Hole. exactly what a Barbie butt is. So some people need to get their holes shut uh-huh. because um, their colons are diseased. And so they have to now get a pouch to where their um, oh, intestinal contents will exit. I so mean, there's they, so many atrocities in the world health-wise. Why do you have to t- bring that up all the time? Because <laughs> you know Crohn's I mean? disease so many, is a real there's thing. There's Lyme. There's all kinds of things. AIDS, uh, Ebola. Ebola. Just there's Barbie Gaybola. Gaybola. What's oh, Gaybola? That's West Hollywood. <laughs> is that AIDS? That's just West Hollywood. Oh, but... Um, yeah, I don't want to hear about the atrocities right now, man. Because we're in Hawaii. It's a good atmosphere. It's island fever. It's good, man. So really let's happy get, you're here, John. Yeah, now. John. It's the best, dude. I like sitting next to you at dinners, man. I like sitting next to you. I'll tell you why, man. Why? Yeah. What? I'll what? tell you why I like John now. Yeah. Because um, I like making him laugh. Look at He laughs at the right <laughs> m- moments. And it's not forced. He's generally laughing. He's a genuinely la- a good laugher. That's how I feel about you. When I get a win out of you, yeah. and I say something that genuinely makes me makes you laugh, uh-huh. I'm on a high for the rest really? of the day. Yeah. There is a little high to getting you to laugh. Really? Especially it if it's like a cackle. Like, you know, we've had those, you and I, where I we're like... Oh, you and I, when we're in the zone? Yeah, when we're in the, the, the zone. The laugh zone? I love it. What's nothing, the laugh zone like, there's when you guys... Nothing, it's better than heroin, I imagine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, him and I, like, can't breathe. We're, like, on the floor crying. Yeah. There, but it's There's only, not a lot of people I can get there with. I can get there with my brother. Yeah. I can get there with Kalila. Andrew? Never. You've, I've never you, gotten there with him. Is that all acting on the podcast? I've seen you like cackle on that. <laughs> no, it's different. It's, it's different. a different kind of cackle. It's, it's literally like, and it's usually an inside joke and that only him and I get. Yeah. His is a theatrical cackle. You hear that, Santino? So Santino, I do three theatrical cackles with you, <laughs> which means that like, you know, in a scene I can yeah. laugh and I can cackle, right? even though I don't even know what the fuck is going on. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's with Andrew. I don't know what the fuck is going on. You know what I mean? But with Koreans, especially like Peter Kim, I can get there. There's yeah. a cackle, yeah. Y- yeah, even dumbfounded, maybe. Interesting, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can, I can get there with those Koreans. But Because um, Peter Kim is a dirty one. He's a yeah. dirty, fat, ugly Korean, and I love it. But you force him to look at he's, your <laughs> penis tip. He's Are also <laughs> He's also got the hottest husband in the world. Exactly. I, I don't understand. It's one of the wonders of the world, really. You, know, I mean, you have you the Great have Wall. You have the Great Wall, and you have, you know what I mean? You have him, the, the boyfriend. <laughs> the Great Wall. <laughs> <laughs> Peter's gay boyfriend. No, I'm just saying. It's like, and I bet you money, right, either Peter's boyfriend is the R word. Yeah. Which is what? Rectum strong. No. <laughs> that's What's the, the word? word. That's the word. That's the word? Yeah, he's rectum strong. strong. He's obviously rectum strong. He's very rectum he's strong. Gay. <laughs> yeah, he's yeah. gay. When you, when you work with the, when you work with the muscle and you're exercising it, absolutely. My butthole is like has never been to the gym almost. <laughs> <laughs> you know, my butthole, like if you analyze my butthole, oh, that dude's never used that except for poo. <laughs> One you know use I mean? only. Yeah. There's no. It's just. It's just sad. Yeah. But if you see like, you know, Lance Bass's. But I'm pretty sure it's like, whoa, look at the muscles on that thing. It's like a sea urchin. So you're saying it's like... <laughs> what? You what? Say, oh, you're Hawaii, saying yeah. that like assholes can get buff? I think so. You have a buff oh, asshole? No, not buff. No, it's like, it's been through uh, a purple heart. Let's just say that. You're a hero. Yeah. It's been through some wars, <laughs> Right. It's, you know, it's smoking. But we'll hear it. <laughs> it's got an eye patch, you that know what I mean? That doesn't necessarily make sense. <laughs> I, I feel like we're getting in trouble. Actually, yes. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting in trouble, but I think we're I, just, like, I imagine. The, the, like the pussy, say, for instance. Oh, I've like seen like some the of The more those. you use it, yeah. like the tighter and stronger it gets. And the more, the, the, the bigger, the, the more efficient the gorilla grip. Like when I, I think that's the opposite. I think no, 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 the no, less no, you do it. No, no, no. You've been th- throwing that fucking theory out. For years, okay, Just and I believed sex. you. I believed you. What is a kegel? Is it not a muscle? It is. And if if you're constantly getting um taking a dick in, and it's constantly doing this on the dick, what is that muscle doing? Growing and getting stronger and getting grippier, right? Jesus. <laughs> what you're saying is the whole vaginal 
tube is a muscle. It's a tube. I think it's a. We call it. It's a cave. It that, that whatever now? you want to say. Vaginal walls. It's not a tube. If I looked inside it, right? Yeah. And I, I didn't see the vag- vaginal lips. Yeah. So you're just a photo of just the tube inside. Subway. It's a subway. It's a, subway. A, tube. a tube. Yeah. Okay. Hence. <laughs> where were you thinking of? Yeah. What are you thinking of? I mean, it's as a, a woman. A tube tell us. Is like a like where you put posters inside, like a little poster. And what tube. is a penis? Yeah. A, a poster. A poster. <laughs> uh, you know. You know. You know what? I'll, I'll name something. It, it's a chamber. Yeah. Of secrets. It's a chamber of secrets. It's a Harry Potter. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it, it's a mystery. Because when you go in, look at it, you, there's so much going on. The fallopian tubes and... What the, else do you know? The kind of uh, juices that come out of there. You yeah. think it's pee. It's, it's not, not, right? Yeah. You think it's... But it's a discharge. Mm. Oh, he knows the word. Right, it's a discharge. It's a discharge. Yeah. Not just discharge, you know, a, a discharge. discharge. And I have to say something. I'm going to say something gross, but when that stuff dries, it's crunchy and it's delicious. <laughs> Let's just throw that out there. That's anyway. so sweet. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Is that I, sweet? I go down there. <laughs> it's great. It's like it's like a, it's like the um, what do you call it? The um, what's that candy? That's like candy. It's that a candy. Like just a, listen to the candy. It's it's a brittle. <laughs> is it brittle? Oh, it's peanut brittle. Peanut, peanut brittle. brittle. I is, love peanut brittle. Yeah. <sighs> and a female's discharge when dried, it's like peanut, but it tastes like yeah shit. <laughs> <laughs> Not brittle. Is it the crunchiness? Anyway, let's move on. Yeah. It's, I, I'm not a scientist, but anyway, welcome to another episode. My point is, is that um, it's a chamber of secrets, and um, yeah. and, and I'll just let let me reiterate. I don't want to talk about buttholes anymore, but uh, a, a, a gay man's butthole is a deli- it's it's a normal butthole, and yeah. let's just I don't want to get in trouble. It's all not the same. Buff. It's all the same. It's yeah. all the same. But, oh no! Can I just say about the vaginal? Because um, I don't want to be mean, but I hooked up with somebody, <laughs> right? Um, the stinky one. Don't say stinky. <laughs> Don't say stinky. Not her, okay. Unique, it's not stinky. unique. The unique one, the right? Unique. And I just, I think that your theory is wrong. Why? FYI. And we'll talk about it later. Okay. I think your theory is wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of, okay. Yeah. I, I don't, it, I don't, I, th- I feel like what you're saying is, is that if I stuck my penis in a virgin's vagina, yeah. and then I suck my penis in somebody that's an average, somebody in their 30s that a- has average sex, okay. I'd be able to feel the difference. I could... Dude, okay, do you, do, okay. let me ask you, do yeah. you think I'd feel the difference? Okay, so everyone's vaginal anatomy is very different. In the same way, you guys have different penis sizes, so it's really hard to tell. You get a virgin who his anatomy is a little bit wider he? set. She. Okay. Whose <laughs> anatomy is a little wider set. Like, that's why, like, I'm not a size queen. Like, you can hit the back of me. Do you, you know can, what I mean? You can hit the back of her. Oh, you're saying that you, the tunnel's not long or the chamber's not long. No, and I have friends who are super petite who, like, are so proud of their extra large vaginas that, like, extend to their throats because they're size queens. I have a friend who honestly weighs 80 pounds and she's yeah. the most petite girl and she was like, I can take the most massive dick. It's never ending. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah. She's Hallelujah. not the girl you want to enter. With. I don't want to be. I don't. I don't want that. Don't ever introduce me to that person. Okay. Hallelujah. <laughs> You're right. And I, you know, it's a mixed bag. It's a mixed bag. And, and since we're playing Hogwarts Legacy, you know, it's like you know, when you go to Zonko's. <laughs> we don't. What's a Zonko's? What's a Zonko's? What's a Zonko's? Is, that, or, uh, is that what it's can, called? The Zonko's candy, candy shop store. It's a candy shop. Yeah, yeah fro- it's a candy shop. Chocolate frogs. When you go to Zonko's, right? Chocolate frogs. You yeah. could eat. You could. <laughs> yeah, you could eat something that's very small, right? And it could just, you just don't know. Chocolate right? frog? Like if they sold vaginas, yeah. right, in Zonko's, which is something that they should sell, yeah. right? Magical. It's magical. That's it. You don't know what you're getting. So you can get a small one, you eat it, and you go, oh, well, that was much larger than, you know what I mean? Anyway, let's. <laughs> <laughs> we just did a Hogwarts vagina. Uh, it's at Hogsmeade. <laughs> yeah. I yeah. have a dilemma. <laughs> can we start the show first? Oh, and yeah, then- yeah, yeah. Okay. okay, so um, five, four. Don't do that. Okay. We don't do that now. We won't do that. You like doing that? It feels good to start it. Uh, because it's your brand. And also, it's ra- something, it's, <laughs> yeah, my brand to count down from five. <laughs> well, you do, you have two things that you do in the show, right? You yeah. do the countdown, countdown in a voice, yeah, and unhelpful advice voice, yeah, I right. Mean, so that's your thing. It is my thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and I don't want to take away we, one of your things. Can we keep my thing in? Can we do the countdown, please? <laughs> yeah, I, that, I feel like that's why you did it. I got to do it. Okay, let's do it. <clears throat> Four, three, two, 
to. Do you feel good? I feel great. I feel needed. Very good. Welcome to another. Uh, what do you? What? Just a tiny <laughs> sip. So I never you drink just, coffee. Can I just say something right now? Last night you did some, the same fucking bullshit. Oh, the rice. We're at the restaurant, right? Yeah. There's a bowl of rice in the middle of the table. <laughs> I scoop rice onto my plate, right? Then you eat the rice off of my plate. It's closer. And no, it's you, not. And then you run Get out of your rice. own shit, man. <laughs> It's in the middle. Of the, it wasn't even that far, man. It was too far. It's not, it wasn't far at all, man. And I, I give you the thing. I just all right, so that don't. Get, is there other Diet Cokes? You have to learn a lesson. Your own fucking Diet Coke. It's family style. All right, here you go. Thank it's you. family style Coke. Right, here you go. Thank you. So welcome to uh, another episode of Tiger Belly. I, um, you know, I had a food thing. Um, I had a, a virus. A food. You're saying that it's not from the food I ate. I was in New York City. It could okay. be from the food uh, you ate. I, I shot one day on a Thursday, and um, also it's like, uh, can I just talk about craft service? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they can be good. Well, tell people what craft service is. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's just like, um, craft service is an area when you're on a set or whatever, and they have candies and whatnot, right? And they have pretzels and just things that you can eat, fruits. You know what I mean? It's like a Zonko's. It's like, no, it's not like Zonko's. It's not. Okay. <laughs> it's not like Zonko's. The way you describe Zonko's sounds like <laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> If it was Zonko's, I'd be happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? There was no jelly beans or yeah, nothing. Yeah, 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 you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> and so, you know, the, the craft service on that show, Sex in the City, I've seen better. Okay? Yes. But there's another thing that they do, and I've never seen this before. There's a little Asian man. He's so cute. I forgot his name. What? What are you walking away for? Okay. There's a little Asian man that every 20 minutes goes, do you want something to eat? <laughs> right? Does he go to your trailer? Yeah, every, he goes to every trailer, what do you want to eat now? And he'll give you like a list of eight things, uh-huh. right? And he go chicken tenders, um, Caesar salad, and oh, wow. a chicken soup or whatever, right? And whenever it comes, I open the box and I just put it in the trash can. Why? It's not good. Oh, why do you keep ordering from him? Because there's, there's, because at the craft store, I don't know where else to go. I want to uh, know. So, let, so I'm going to just tell you, it was Thursday, <laughs> I didn't eat all day long. Okay? What were the options? Well, I, I'm pretty sure the fancy ladies on the show don't eat it either. They have a secret thing that they do. SJ doesn't eat craft No, they have, they have their own food. I see. You know what I mean? It's like fucking avocados and mangoes. <laughs> it's just like delicious shit. Just right? pre cut. Right? And I had yeah. this chicken tender that's fucking, you know what I mean? So hard. You know how like the, the crust has overcrusted the yeah, chicken? Yeah, yeah. And the chicken's all dry? S- stringy. Yeah. yeah. Don't like it. And I look at the fancy girl ladies on the show and then hello. And they're eating their fucking mango shit. <laughs> anyway, so what happens is Thursday, I'm like, you know what? I'm not gonna eat any of this shit. What I'm gonna do is if I wrap right on time, I'm gonna race to the hotel and I'm gonna get the restaurant there. It's delicious. At the hotel. Yeah, I shouldn't say this right now because I love that hotel. So, yeah, no, a different hotel. Okay, I went to a different hotel. Different guys, it's a different yeah. one. Trump Tower, love it. I went to one of, one of Trump's hotels. Yeah, in Soho. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's where I stay. The Trump Tower in Soho, and I go there and I get the seafood platter. Yum! You do that all the time. I love chilled seafood platters. You know me, so good. But what I, I didn't know the secret. And then after I had, I ate, ate one, I had four hours of straight up, it's not even diarrhea, because I wouldn't even, it's so liquefied, <laughs> it's, I wouldn't even consider it diarrhea. There's no shit in there. It's just fresh food. No. It's fresh seafood. So you ate it, it didn't even get like digested. But it's not in, no, my body went, let's turn that into liquid. Oh. And let's put some fire in it. <laughs> right? Fire. <laughs> yeah, like my stomach, you know me, is a trickster. Just like they, you would see at Zonko's, right? <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, so I, I'm not kidding you. It was literally like, oh. like for four hours straight oh. of Zonko, you know what I mean? <laughs> Seafood juice with fucking, you know, spice. Yeah. Okay. So, you know, David King, my bud. Uh-huh. You know David King? Mm-hmm. Love him. The Jew. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? The creative little Jew that we know. Yeah. Esther's boyfriend. Yeah. Fiance. Never get married. 
You know that. You never know. They're not going to get married. You know that, right? <laughs> They're not going to get married. So don't say that again. And she shouldn't change her name to Esther King until they get married. It drives me crazy. You tell her that? No. Oh, she's Esther King. I didn't know. Yeah. That. So you told her that I said that. Okay. Well, I'm going to bring it up on the next show. Yeah, bring it up. You have it, beef it, infuriates, with her. it infuriates me. I think it has a great ring to it, Esther King. And it will when they get married. You don't, <laughs> don't think. Change the, don't um, change You the know rules. what? I'm going to change my government name. There's nothing to stop me. I'm going to be Kalila Lee. Wow. She's going to take her name without your permission. How does no, that make I, you no, feel? I don't, How does that I, make you feel? I don't sign off on it. But you don't have to. What? Oh, you know, I'm, I'm going to change my decune. Okay, I'd be happy to. <laughs> okay. What is happening? I'll change it to Kuhn. Yeah. Because I don't want the same last name as you right now. <laughs> I would in the future. <laughs> no, but right now in this moment, no. You know what I'm going to change it to? What? Kuhn Lee. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Just, well, it's got Kuhn Lee. Yeah. Um, I think there's nowhere else you can go. It's yeah. Actually, Zelensky. <laughs> <laughs> in honor of Ukraine. I like I'll be that. Bobby Zelensky. Bobby Z. That yeah, Bobby Z. good. Bobby Z. Can we go back to diary or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, um, Fire spice. So I get, I get the, them to dr- deliver... A little secret emodium AD. Love it. Right. Wait, you got it from Dave? No, I got it from a delivery from it's New York. So yeah. you know what I mean? They rush it over. I take four of them. Oof, okay. Jeez. Right? It stops the party from going. My stomach's going, shut it down. You the know what I mean? Everything. The cops yeah, yeah. come, yeah. The cops come, everything, right? And then for two days, I slept the whole time. I I I, it, 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 I, I, I went in and out of consciousness. That's how sick I was. Wow. It was devastating. And so you're saying, oh, so the, and then later a New Yorker was like, hey, buddy, you don't eat fucking seafood at, on Thursday. Mm. I wonder why. Because they get their shit on Sunday. I did not I know see. that. They go to the, think about it, John, they go to the market on Sunday, all the restaurants. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Saturday, you're fucked. I also wonder don't if. Don't get scallops on a Saturday in New York. But Damn. also, it's like, was this a specifically a seafood place, or they just had seafood on the menu? Because that's, that's a good question. my my thing is, I'm not going to eat seafood go. at a non seafood place. Where was this steakhouse? It's a fancy place. It's a fancy. But is place. it known for fancy seafood? Is uh, well, let me ask you this, friend. Um, is is Boa known for seafood? No, it's a steakhouse. I but would they never have- order seafood there. Good point. I would never order good point. seafood there. Yeah. Would you rather eat at Red Lobster or Boa Seafood? Oh, that's a good... Mm. Honestly? Yeah. Red Lobster. Wrong. All right, let me ask you another one. You're yeah. wrong. Yeah. You, might, How be, about you this? might be wrong. Yeah, you're right. You're wrong. You know where I get my seafood food, right? <laughs> what? Where? Do you, where, where do you get the, seafood? A restaurant that says so-and-so seafood. You already know. I don't want to give it away because it's my favorite spot. Okay, what about this? Let me ask you this. What? Would you... Is, is Bubba Gump better? Oof. There we go. Yeah, that's good. That's it. So that in but, your face. But the likelihood of me getting sick at Bubba Gump probably it's less. less. But not Because the, they're churning out seafood much faster. It's not kind of staying. So they get the, it in gigantic look, quantity. I'm, I'm not a restaurateur. I don't know how their process works, <laughs> but I just assume if it's going out fast, they're probably replacing it fast. I'm not going to go to a place that's had their seafood there frozen for. Anyway, long story short, okay. I almost died. I did FaceTime you. Most died, yeah. And um, that was at the end of your sickness, and I could tell that you were really struggling. You also looked slimmer. Mm-hmm. So I believe you. Yeah. And then guess what happened? What? what? So I canceled Saturday night. My show's at the cellar. But then Sunday, I had to go to the cellar to do Bobby Kelly's podcast. And when I showed up the cellar, and I love them so much, but they go, how come you canceled last night? And I go, oh, I had food poisoning. They go, Pussy. <laughs> Pussy. So I guess in New York, you know what I mean? If you're a New York comic, they, they do stand up, you know what I mean, in any state. Because <laughs> they're real men. They're real comics. Not this guy. Maybe they just have buff buttholes. Wreck them strong. Wreck them strong, strong. Mm-hmm. in New York. Mm-hmm. You know? But I love the gays a lot. I, um, <laughs> I'll tell you why. Because there was this guy, Mario Cantone. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's on um, Sex in the City. Is that the really handsome guy you showed me a Very picture no, of? No, no, the other one's Armin. Oh, okay, he's There's handsome. multiple men that are... Oh, you, no, Armin's not gay. Oh. Armin's... I, he's from Iran or whatever. Is that gay? <laughs> <laughs> Is everyone from Iran gay? What are you talking about? Leave it down in the comments below. So yeah, 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 we gay. don't know. We don't know. You know what I mean? I've heard stories. You know what I mean? But I'm pretty sure no. 
<laughs> but the other one, Mario Gantone, is gay. He was a comic from the 80s yeah. and all that stuff. But um, And just they, they, uh, their fingers, man. Long, short, No, strong. it's just so well manicured. Mm. Their fingers, you know what I mean? And I, you know, I hide mine on set because I, I, everyone on that show is so fancy. You know, they, they're just clean and, and they talk about things I don't know anything about. Such like? as, well, they go, they were talking about play, so I go, um, oh, I heard that play, uh, this, this, and this pissed everyone off. And, 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 and just, just hear me out, right? I don't know play, so. So I go, well, I heard that play, because I was trying to get in the cover, Hamilton. <laughs> Why'd you say that? I go, Hamlet. I go, Hamilton is good. And they're like, what? And I go, Hamilton. And they go, you don't mean Hamilton, do you? I go, I do. You I been, sure do. You should have doubled down. No. Yeah, because Hamilton. the guy that's it, that started Hamilton, Hamilton? Yeah. M- Miranda, uh, Lin-Win Mel? Some black man, fancy black man was there. They're um, blacks, right? He was there? Um, yeah, Adam. he's... Oh, Some no. fancy Leslie, black man, they Leslie go, he's Jr. the guy. Hamilton. Hamilton? Leslie. Leslie, oh, Leslie. Jr. I don't give a fuck. I don't know, man. Yeah. He's great. Wait, so you don't know. Hello. Yeah, hello. You know what I mean? That's what they do. Hello. You know what I mean? I go, fuck off. You know what I mean? So Ham- I don't know nothing. I don't know what wins. Is it w- wins? I'm just trying to throw. What's wins? I, I don't know. I don't know any kind of play. You know what I mean? Oh, and then oh, oh, Maria Canton goes, um, well, you never saw... Um, some other, what's an Asian play? She, he's like, um, Miss Saigon. Miss Saigon. Sa- yeah, that one. Yeah, with Leia Salonga. Yeah, I go, I don't know anyone from there, from Saigon. But anyway, um, I don't know anything about plays. And I don't belong, belong in that group. You know Annie. Wait, why do you have to, um, okay, I don't think you have to know all the oh, plays to God. be friends with someone who likes plays. Like, Listen, I, when, you're, when you're with, that level of like, you know what I mean? They're all from Broadway. They're all from Tony. What's two Tony? They get it. They get the award. Is that a, yeah, is that Tony, a thing? The yeah. Tony Award? Tony. Tony. Yeah. Who's Tony though? I, I who the fuck I is Tony? Who the fuck is Oscar? Who's Oscar? Who's any of these who's people? I don't golden. know who's Golden. Who's Golden? Who's golden? What? Who's golden? golden? I don't know who Golden is. Is it a dog? <laughs> so my point is this, okay? I don't know who these people are that create these war awards, right? But I don't know anything about it. So when they're, you're a Tony person, right? Yeah. And then you, you, you go, hey, you know what I mean? Let's talk about diarrhea. Okay, but that's what I'm yeah, saying. It's like it but, doesn't but, fit right. No, but I feel it like doesn't sit well. You in that situation, they all talk to the same people, the Tony people. You are the vor- you can bring them into your vortex. Exactly. I swear to God that you said Hamilton, and you were like, "Hey, my butt's on fire." Everyone looks at you. Oh, we, I already did that. I tried every trick in the book. But I'm saying, are, don't you think they're bored of hearing the same shit over and over again from each other? Let's try the scenario. I love that part in Hamilton, uh, Sarah. What did you, what did you think about Hamilton? I'm who? You just be Sarah Jessica Barker. George is raising his hand. He wants to be Sarah. <laughs> what, what? Play of Bobby's, uh, Bobby's butthole. Bobby does it. The Bobby's diarrhea, the one man play. We'll do it off Broadway. It'll be beautiful. Can I write this? George has it. George wants to write a one man play of Bobby's butthole. butthole. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. You gonna write it? Yeah. Okay, do it. Okay. I don't know why you. <laughs> But I'm not going to be in it. Somebody <laughs> has to play me. He writes it about Somebody you. has to play me. I'm not playing the yes, butthole. I'll do it. Peter Kim. <laughs> Done. Yeah, Peter Kim's going to be the butthole. So, <laughs> so what but, I'm saying is, yeah. I think that if I were like a person, like podcasting, say, for mm-hmm. instance, like Tiger Belly, I don't want to talk to other people about podcasting. Like, I would just rather talk about everything else but it's podcasting. It's completely different, though. It, imagine this. You're in a green room with Burt Kreischer, Tom Segura, right? And Theo, whatever, right? And some guy walks in who, like, you know, he cuts grass. Okay. <laughs> right? And I'm not saying any, I'm not, land, land I'm not attaching it landscape. to a race or ethnicity, okay? Not, we are not. Why did you even say that? Because you, somebody laughed in the room, and I didn't say Mexican guy. Okay? You just said <laughs> <laughs> I know. Let's rewind, okay? okay. Uh, Landsca- forget forget the landscape. Landscape architect. Forget landscaping. That's fine. Let's, I'm going to try to come up with somebody else, right? Yeah. Pizza delivery boy. Sure. Okay. Man. Is it a boy or man? Or girl? It can happen to be. It can happen, <laughs> it can to, can be. happen to be one as well, right? Yeah. 
And that's all they know. Pizza Hut. They deliver pizza. They walk in. And comics are talking about, oh, what theater are you playing? Or like, how, you know, how much are you charging? This and that. What, what is the pizza going to go? Hey, what's your go. favorite pizza? And you think that Bert and Theo and old Tom Segura and Logan be like, oh, let's. Bert? Yeah. Oh, yeah, for, for sure. For sure, Bert. <laughs> but doesn't that get old? What theater are you playing and talking about the same shit you do all year round, like amongst each other? Like, don't you want like an outside? Yeah. Something? Kala, you, you seem to think that I didn't try Wait, to your... bring up other shit. Like, what did you try to bring okay. up? Well, I try to relate to them on their level. So I go, I said something like, how much, like, does some girl was like, I'm going to, might do a play in San Diego. <laughs> yeah. So I go, oh, I'm from there. She said, okay. Yeah. And then I go, I didn't know what to say. So I go, how much do you get paid <laughs> what did you, for a play why did like you that? Go, why did you go to Mike? I, I don't know. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> and she goes, oh, we, it's like a thousand dollars. I yeah. like that salary transparency. Yeah. A thousand dollars. And I go, a show? That's pretty good. No, she goes for the whole thing for two months. And I go, and I go, why would you do that? It's highway <laughs> robbery. She's like, what do you mean? I go, never mind. You know what yeah. I mean? What's like, like, like those are the kind of conversations. Let's, I let's have. okay. Let's let's walk. Let's, <laughs> What's so funny? Let's let's rewind. Rewind where? Let's start where she says, "I'm going to do a play in San Diego." Yeah. What are other things you could have let's, asked? Yeah, let's outside replay this. of outside of how much do you make? So Kalala, okay, okay here. Kalala, what kind of play is it? What? No, 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 no. no. I'm going to start. Kalala, tell yeah, me about that play you're doing in San Diego. So yeah, like March to May, yeah. I'm doing this at the La Jolla Playhouse. Is that a good play, March to May? Oh, uh, is that me? what it's called? Oh, hi, are you? Hi, Bobby. Oh no, 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 no. Sorry, sorry, I oh, wasn't clear. Oh. I meant like from March, um, the date to May. I'm oh gonna shit, be at the La Jolla my bad. Playhouse, and so I'm doing continue. this thing. Sorry, my bad. Yeah, I was, I'm doing the play out there. So it sounded like a play. I'm pretty excited about it. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Where is it? In, in San Diego. I know you're San Diego, well, but said what? La, she said La Jolla already. You said La Jolla? You're not familiar, you, you've never been? Have yeah. you been to La Jolla? It's beautiful. It's just cold. Yeah, I've never been. Wait, aren't you from San Diego? I am. You're from, I've heard you on your podcast. Why are you lying right now? <laughs> I'm lying. I lie. Oh, why are you lying? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm from the, I'm not from there, but I live there. <laughs> <laughs> I live there. I live there. And I don't know, because I, I, no, in my mind, it's like, where are you, where are you playing? And I don't know where to play. Where and you would play there. Oh, and there's is this. there a theater there? Yeah, La Jolla yeah, Playhouse. La Jolla Playhouse. Oh yeah, I heard of it. Mm -hmm. I've never been there though. Yeah. So, anyways, uh, what's the play? Okay. Um, you know, it's <laughs> try to come back in. What's the I, play? I'm going to try. Of course, okay, I am. Okay. Well, it's this really weird premise about mm. this like giant, um, kind of like this mythical big red fish we're trying to find in the ocean. Oh wow! And, oh. Yeah. Basically. What uh, kind is it? Um, it's a mempachi. Ha have you heard of that fish? It's delicious fish. Do you do omakases? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel like there's a. I feel like, there's a I feel like we were. Mm -hmm. No, omakase we and kankamji. <laughs> but listen, listen. Did you say omakase kankamji? Yeah. We've well, never been there. No, it's omakase. My point is, is this, okay? <laughs> my point is, where are you staying there when you stay? This is your point. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you hitting on my friend? Oh no 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 no! Are you I'm not gonna go down there. I down was, on her? What? What are you doing? Hey. Dude, she's not my type. Wait, I'm right she's here. She's right there. Oh, you're not Why? my type. You I'm not even doing that right you now. You keep talking to both of us like we're on separate conversations. I, I, can I just be honest with you, dude? Yeah. It's like, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I don't know what to say. So I'm just trying to get involved, man. All right, give me a break. All right? So yeah. that's what I'm saying is I don't know what to say. So you know what I do is <laughs> this is what I do. I just don't say anything. Yeah. Right? So I'll, and, I, and I sit like there like this. I mean, that's a good vibe, too. And, like, everyone's, you know, and everyone's talking about all kinds of stuff. I, I, but then one, the, our guy, Armin, who, you know, there's always one guy that's like, uh, I think he's my kind of person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's a guy named Armin, and he hangs out with Mickey Rourke. Because if you look up Armin, and he's always mm -hmm. with Mickey Rourke in the photo. Is that the first thing you did was Google him? Yeah. <laughs> do you do it with everyone around you? Yeah, because I'm bored. Yeah. Mm. Right? So, and also, I don't, because I know that everyone's done something. Right, so it's like I want it like you know the guy with the ha Hamilton. I, he, you know, what I mean, I don't know. So I Google him, yeah, and then I go, oh shit, he's legit or whatever. And then you you Google that girl. There was a girl named from Mississippi Masala. Mm, you did mm. tell me about her. Yeah, yeah. she was, she um was on a she her first movie ever was with Denzel opposite Denzel. Jeez. It's called and it was thirty years ago. It was called Mississippi Masala. Super sweet lady. But you Google all these people because you know you don't want to feel. 
like you're not a part of it. Or sure. that you're but being- I'm literally the odd man out. I mean, even when the main women come, like the two girls from Sex and the City, Cynthia and Dixon. Nixon. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes. And they come on, right? Yep. They come on, Excuse right? Me. And they look at me and they go, hello. I go, hi. You know what I mean? And then that's the only inter- that's the only exchange because I don't want to intrude or I don't want to say anything that's going to offend anybody. So I just shut down. But this guy, Armin, as we're doing the scenes, I look over and he goes like this to me, mm. trying See? to make me laugh. And he goes like this one point, like that. And then I laugh, right? And I go, that's my fu- guy. Yeah. Yeah. That's my guy. You should try dissociating. What's that mean? You just enter a fugue state. Like some, when I'm in like a really high stress situation, I just depart from reality. Oh, I like st- stare off into space and I'm somewhere else. I'm not stressed out. Mm. I feel relaxed. I feel completely relaxed. Even when I have lines now, I don't, there's no fear. Mm. You know what I mean? It's like I'm completely, I feel a part of it because everyone loves me. <laughs> And I can scream. I can scream at. I like. I you know. I do my screaming. Mm-hmm. I heard you the first time, or whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. And everyone laughs. So I, I. They get my personality and how weird I am, right? It's just that I. I have learned over the years to just shut the fuck up. Mm. You know what I mean? That doesn't sound like shutting the fuck up. That sounds like screaming. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> she has a point. Yeah, yeah you're right. Yeah. <laughs> a, you're right. You're right. You're right. That's not, not in that part. Yeah, you're right. In that situation. No, but you no, but I'll tell you that. Uh, yeah, because I, I I'll say things if I know what like you know how comics have, you know, we it's like we don't know if something's gonna get a laugh hundred percent of the time. Mm-hmm. So you have like this meter in your head, right? So if it's anything sixty percent guarantee sixty percent, right? I won't say it. If there's a 60% chance it's going to get a laugh, I won't say it. It's got to be 90, 95%. I have a question yeah, about yeah. that. Do you always feel the need to be on then? Because you're like, oh, this is the comic. This is the comedian. So do you feel pressure to whatever you say has to land as a joke or funny? Or you can't just speak normally and just be like, oh, you know, I don't have to be funny in this room. I don't have to stand out. I can just talk normally. Yeah. Do you feel that pressure? I did think I do, yeah. Mm. I think I I think I need to go. Uh, I need people to think that I'm funny when I first meet them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially if they don't know who I am. You know what I mean? Yeah, but your natural self is the funnier than your switched on self. I think. You think so? I think so. I mean, yeah, dude, we were dying at fucking Hagen Dogs last night. This, Wait, what happened? I, I left. Mean, this, <laughs> so there's a bunch of people in line in front of us. Oh yeah. They may be a race. <laughs> From the, to the boys, Gilbert, to the boys. from the eastern side of the world, mm-hmm. and they were just taking so long to order. So Bobby starts to imitate them, but it's also, you know, not quiet. So all you hear <laughs> yeah. is something going, like, yeah. oh, like Rocky Road. <laughs> oh, I need that Rocky Road. No. Oh, I mean, chocolate cheese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. We're all like, what yeah, yeah, the yeah, fuck? I, I, hey. No, I was, I was going, excuse me, please. <laughs> I was like, excuse me, please. Can I, per- can I take every paper? So it has nothing to do with the accent. We were upset. We were a little <laughs> yeah, upset yeah. because it it's was- the, they're asking for every flavor. So they're yeah. taking so long, but then we realized for a sample. But we realized we were wrong because it wasn't really them. It was it, the, then we realized it was the, the thing. The people that were working there because they <laughs> yeah, were even worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so what flavor you want? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Then they were. So I was like, oh, so, it wasn't the Japanese so, people. It's the fucking people behind so the counter. No one could understand each other. That's yeah. why it took so but long. I think that you're setting a great example for, like, <laughs> you know, the start Asian hate campaign. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, you're right. I mean, for me, it's like when I see other Asians yeah. acting not the way I want them to act, <laughs> right? I start, like, I'll go hard on them. More like because of, like, you have a higher expectation to your people. Well, I, you know, I have a rule about any any. Buddy, go, waiting in line to get anything in terms of food service, right? That's true, because you were, he was shitting on everyone, because there's one couple that went up to the line. That said, uh, they were waiting the whole time like us. They say, what do you want? They stopped, turned around, and looked at the menu. Yeah, and they had to spend the whole fucking time. So then I said, I, you know, what did I say? I go, when I order, I'm going to look at the menu, too. <laughs> so he turned around. So I turned around, I did exactly what they did, right? Just to get a laugh from these guys. But my point, though, is this. Is that, <laughs> my, my point is this, though, is this, um, that, um, you know... When I'm waiting in a big line, right? Yeah. What am, let me ask you something. What do you think I'm thinking of? If when you're What's waiting. the most important thing? Who's the most important person? If I'm waiting in line, who am I thinking of the most important person in the building or people? 
um, the wait staff? No. You? No, waiting in line. Um, oh, 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 the person behind you. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Courtesy. That's the only thing I think about. Yeah, same, I, and same, I, and, same. And, and I want to sh- look at the person behind me and go, wasn't that quick? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know oh, I mean? I, You're I'm welcome. with you. I'm with you. <laughs> exactly. But people in front of me, don't think about me. <laughs> they, t- they don't think about me. <laughs> Oh, oh, what, 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 you're right. <laughs> Can I take every paper? You know, it's like, what are you doing? Think about me. Yeah. Think about us. It doesn't have to be an Asian. It could be and, anyone. And it could be anybody, anyone. but they just happen to be fucking Asians, yeah. right? No, I, I, I'm fully a hundred thousand you. percent with you. Thank you. Because you're the same way, right? Like, I'm exactly the same way. Like, I, I, I it makes me anxious when I know I'm holding up a line. She wouldn't so even like, ask for extra creamer because I felt, wouldn't <laughs> because there was a line behind me. I like it. So I'm like, no, I'm not. Fuck I'm the sorry. creamer. And then I called Gilbert on my way home. Do we have creamer at home? Because I, and he was like, why don't you ask? I was like, creamer. there was a line behind me. I'm not going to inconvenience them. But probably also a little bit codependent and not healthy. Um, I well, do want to ask you a could, really could strange I just, question. I, could, I, I don't want to, I know I'm going to listen to your question. I don't want to shy away from this topic real quick, okay. though. Yeah. All right. I have one more thing to say. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Here's another thing. <laughs> If you're with a group, if in a line, right? Yeah. Order together. <laughs> Pull your money together and order together. This because what? No. He, he leads, no, 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 you're he, correct. If he you do example. it individually, right? Yeah. It just takes Longer. fucking forever. Especially if there's a line. Right. And if you're like, oh, I'm sorry. You know, we don't have money. <laughs> <laughs> what is that scenario? <laughs> you waited like ah we don't no have- but you know what I mean they're like we don't want to like maybe one guy has a credit card the oh, other yeah. one you know what I mean I don't know what their situation have one guy figure it out my he go did ahead. that you did that so Thank the way you. I do it in my family is we always send a representative to mm-hmm. line up so that the line isn't like eight people longer. So we're all in line together. The line is longer. It's confusing. Um, we choose a credit card and we move fast. I take the orders and I'm like, this, 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 this. I'm out, right? Yeah. But okay. there is always, I've had this experience where there is always one person. Like we split, let's say we agree to split the bill. Mm-hmm. I've had a person do this to me. Well, I didn't order the mac and cheese side, so I don't think we should split evenly. Nah, I guess get that whole thing. That, you know what you do in that situation? You cut that friend out of your life. <laughs> <laughs> you erase their number. Wrong. You look them in the eye and go, this is no longer... The root. A thing. You cut the root. Yeah. A stable thing. Okay? Yeah. I like that. Yeah. But I fully agree with you. you if, uh, if it's like at, uh, let's say... Friend. I'm being real. You cut them out of your life. But I think this is why you... Who's, went- do you know him? It's you have a name you want to say? No. Okay. No, give me a name. I have a couple I will names. cut. Yeah, I will cut them too. <laughs> oh, so even for her, you'll cut Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want that in my life. I don't either. Yeah, I can't, I can't have it. I can't do it. I can't live like that. I can't live and like that. And everyone agree? Yeah. 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 Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I. it's crazy. It's crazy, crazy town. Crazy behavior. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like it. The question I had for you is okay, completely ahead. unrelated. But have you ever done the racist Asian pull the ice chinky move before? Yes. Who hasn't if you're Asian? Wait, Asians do that too? I do it all the time. I do, I do it. To, it makes people, it makes white people laugh when you even, and, you do it extra. And uncomfortable. That's why yeah, I like so it. what I do is I do this one. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, look yeah. at you. See, Klaus, see and, how you're laughing? And, see, you're yeah, national, and you're white natural. people love it. And I go real thick on the accent. But see, I like pushing it past. <laughs> You know what I mean? I do that. But, but then they get nervous, and I like that more. Yeah, yeah. I love it. See how you laugh naturally at that? Naturally. It's funny. Why? What is your... No, because when we were younger, we, there was a song involved with the different... Chinese, Japanese, Japanese, Japanese something knees. And Korean. Korean is you'd have to hang. There, we had a song related to... Because you would pull... Oh, yeah. Dude. You would pull the eyes apart, but in different directions. Yeah, we all had a game like that. Okay, do you yeah, know yeah. the remember the song though? No, we didn't have Korean at the end. No, it's Korean. Yeah, we didn't do that. We did Chinese, Japanese, something new. dirty knees, look dirty at these. Knees. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I don't know what that means, dirty, dirty knees, knees, look at these, but I think it it's I think it's like- I think it's Southeast Asian because it's Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees is brown. Well, no, I don't know, man. It's not? No. Sounds why would like, why do you why look like would, you're, no, no, you no, look you like, you're like, no man, no. No, because I've seen Vietnamese people, their knees are clean. <laughs> 
<laughs> Did you have the cleanest knees I've ever seen? So I don't, that doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. And also, it's, let's look at these. Look at somebody Google that. <laughs> Uh, Chinese, George, Japanese, Jordanese, George, look at these. What the fuck your, is... You jumped on your phone a little too fast there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know it. That's because I didn't Have know Have you heard of that, yeah, yeah. John? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They usually point at their nipples. When they're oh, look nipples. at these. Yeah. That's what it is. Oh, that, oh look at it's these. not look at the knees. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what's dirty knees mean, though? Like, I think it just rhymes. I don't know. It rhymes. It just it rhymes. rhymes. Like, what's a dirty knees type of Asian? That's I have a I mean, yeah, yeah. then it's Not dirty knees, but like like Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees, like a dirty Asian. Who are the dirty Asians? I think that I thought that's what it was. That's not what it was, no. I never got that from but that. But you thought it was knees. It is knees. I don't think it is. Well, that's why you're Googling it. What does it say? I think Google? Gilbert's right. I don't think it's the actual knees, like the leg knees. Then well, is it, it, it what what is it then? It's just a, like it, it's just a, a made up word. Well, I'm mean, like, there's so many other words you could do. So Chinese, Japanese. <laughs> yeah, let's, you let's, know what I mean? Let's Hello, it. please. <laughs> Hello, please. Look at these. <laughs> That's better. Oh, right? my God. You're right. So the act spelled out, the chant goes Chinese, Japanese, Japanese. dirty knees. Exactly. Look at these. Yes. There's no Korean there? <laughs> no, your, you your version, filthy, I think you, you added filthy that. Filipino <laughs> bastards came up with Korean. Well, can I tell you, when yeah. we when we said yeah. Korean, yeah. you had to pull your face extra wide. Yeah, I know. That's, see, that's what I'm saying. That's, and that's why I'm hostile towards you. Oh. My God, uh, we're hostile towards you. I know. You take over our land indiscriminately. Mm. Well, discriminately. Really? Um, you don't complain about the Spanish doing it? Yeah, we do. We hate them. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> we killed Magellan. Yeah. What does this? What does it mean, though? The thing? It's just that it's literally that. And then I think in a movie, MC Jen said, I think there's also a line people do when you say, "Look at these," or "Look at." Look at my knees or something mm -hmm. like that. that. You reply, oh, these are Chinese. What kind of knees are these? Chinese. Or is it is it bad that we're unearthing? No, this, well, this like, is very common. Is no, this is. So we'll get pulled, pulled from circulation after this. Really? Oh. I have really good news for you. Wait, his jokes, man. Let me let me see something, man. <laughs> They're on fire right now. No, it's not on fire. This They're guy great. right here. They're great, dude. And then, up. but John, last night at dinner, right? <laughs> He, I don't even well, know what the like fuck you he, No, I'm just man. stop, stop. I don't know what the fuck he was talking about, right? But I turn to John and I go, wow, he's a, such a great storyteller. Like, you just don't know how to. Re, where are you going? I'm coming over here to a mic. Oh, oh, oh shit. shit. Defend bad. himself. Defend yourself, my man. You make me a worse storyteller because the second <laughs> I open my mouth, I could say, the. You do, you're like, whoa, you this is going to be boring. That. So I have to skim through all the interesting points. There's nothing <laughs> left to my story. I'm just like, highlights. Me. Look how uh, he was thinking about it. Right yeah, yeah. Me. India. Gay bar. Bye. <laughs> yeah. There is a look that you do that I see. It's, it's, he gets I, so nervous. You go. I'm like, it's okay, so what's subtle. the shortest version of this story I can tell? And it's none of the, inter I, I take out all the interesting parts, all the color, all the flavor. It's the just flavor? <laughs> but he, here's what you don't get, get my friend. Is there right? flavor? I'm trying to get you to hit a ball. And, and, and I'm giving you a little pressure to hit a ball because if you hit the ball, you make me look like a fool. Oh, interesting. Right? Yeah. So it's like, I'm just giving you like glory, he but did. you fail <laughs> every time. That's all. You don't speed no. it up. <laughs> hold, you should, hold your ground. Tell Every the story. Every time I'm in the batter's box, you throw a heater. No, I just do you a thing never, with my eyes. You never let me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Here we go. You know what I mean? You're but like, if you, you hit, throw it out of the strike zone, hit, so I don't even have a chance to. That's hit. not what it is. You I'm giving you a law. If you hit the ball, I look like the fool, and you win. So you're helping him, really. I'm trying to help you. He's really then helping I'm going to pay attention to everybody but you. Podcasting with you is a high-pressure sport. I mean, like, there are times where I feel like I can relate Olympics. to George yeah. because if I don't say it, then <sighs> if brevity isn't the first, you know, if I don't... He's doing it right now. Oh, Fight oh, through shit. it. Oh, see, you got her. No. You're so good at this. I've never seen her. She's like, oh, God. Uh, speed it up, Kalila. Speed oh, it no, up. No, no, no. He's... he's <laughs> You do feel accomplished going through it, for sure. Here's what I'll say. Bobby's face is but, Oscar wrap-up music. But George, he is kind of, this is just the kind of coach he is. It's like he's training you for the kumite. He wants you to be the best fighter there is. So it's like if you, in, in the past eight years, haven't already figured out how to get him, like I know how to get him. Okay. Now, maybe not in this podcast, but like outside, like in regular I've life. It. I've seen it. 
And that's where I think you need just a little bit more. You got to go for it, George. Okay. I apologize. I really do. I don't like that about myself. I love this too. This is another obstacle. I like <laughs> this, is an obstacle. this is a good Dude, one. See, that's what I'm saying. You think everything's a trick. It's not a trick. You all think you're everything's all, a trick. It's I not. feel like you're always training I'm us. Not training you're anybody, training us, dude. I'm not training anybody. I'm apologizing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bro, what does that even mean? What the fuck? I, I can't even. What are you doing now? <laughs> See, that's how you get here. <laughs> no, that's exactly. Yeah, that was fake. Yeah, she yeah. Was, no, 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 no. That's exactly. I set you up. Yeah. If Bobby doesn't fail, <laughs> I set you up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I yeah, set you up. <laughs> I'm trying to learn. Go ahead. You just set me up, huh? That was really good. The one way I know to get Bobby's undivided attention is to pretend I'm not listening. He gets his feelings hurt really bad because he's no longer the That's center. That's so not true. That's so of, like, and so what I do is like, uh-huh, mm-hmm. And no. he's like, and then he goes harder. Babe, babe, you got to listen. You got to listen. And he wants my full attention. I just want and you to listen because like, this is a show second. we're doing. And I'm like, one second. <laughs> you know, we're doing a show. That's why. But you see, George, yeah, 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 you just yeah. cannot be too thirsty to like give him what he wants. And then you'll get everything you want out of him. Which I will say has taught me in other interactions where I'm like running the show because of him. But also this segs into my next. Go ahead. <sighs> this is hard for me to say. Don't cry though because I'm in that mode. <laughs> well, you'll Please, start don't crying. cry. Don't cry. <laughs> Wait, I, th- last week was a fake cry or the other week was I, a fake cry. You cry sometimes. I don't oh, like it. Go people, ahead. a TikTok went around, by the way, of that. Her talking about her, act, or she was talking about cancer. People thought she was actually going to die because people clipped it out. Do they you remember court. that? Yeah. Yeah, that kind of went around, and I had friends and family who were like, you're dying? I'm like, no. I'm, like, what the fuck? I'm not dying, my God. Um, so it's recently been brought to my attention that um, by people that I've dated that one of the biggest barriers to dating me is that um, it seems as though I always put you first mm-hmm. and that um, you are always a priority and um, and I feel like I don't know how to not like put you first. Mm-hmm. So what are your thoughts on that? I th- okay. Another thing is, I feel like I've been groomed. <laughs> you you grooming her dog? <laughs> I feel like I've been like hard like programmed to just like be at your beck and call like always. And I don't know how you did it, but you did it. You know, in any, every, any given moment, in any city, there are parties going on at the same night. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay? Some parties are better than others. And there are some parties are the parties you want to be in. That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> <laughs> so you can fuck with these little parties, right? All you want, right? <laughs> But if you want to go to the gala, ah, uh, you're the gala, the Met Gala. He's the Met Gala. Mm-hmm. This is the party, baby. And um, your little parties, you know what I mean? Yeah, they have muscles. You know what I mean? <laughs> they drive trucks. They make they jewelry. They make jewelry. Stop. Oh, what? Yeah, they do. Stop yeah, they it. do. Right? They make jewelry. Right? They're they're clean. You know what I mean? And, and they look good on the yeah. Insta, right? But it's not this party, dude. You know, this party is chaos. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's, it's Doctor Strange Plus. You know what I mean? It's like <laughs> it's the multiverse. It's multiverse. It's the multiverse. Right, right. It's like there's things going on. You know what yeah. I mean? And it's like you're gonna miss it. So you can go to your regular party with the beer. You know what I mean? <laughs> and, you know what I mean? And the little DJ, this and that. But if you want fucking cosmic fucking experiences, and um, yeah, you gotta you gotta buy a ticket, man. And you bought the ticket. And you know what? You're the smart one. I think he's doing it again. I don't know. <laughs> what are we doing? I'm doing what? I don't know. I, like, I just bought whatever this was. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I'm like, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Like, yeah. You're be in the gala. Yeah, it's, uh, listen, man. You know what I mean? Hello. Hi. Hi. Why Hello. am I saying hi to him right now? You know? But my point is, I'm not the part. Listen, all right? You can do it. I don't, I don't ask you to put me in first. You think I ask you? Um, or, or is it key he doesn't even have to? I, I think that he no longer has to. He could just call me and be like, "Some this happened," and immediately I'm like, "I got it." Yeah, but then don't do that because if I say I'm sick, then you you are oh you gotta drink lots of water, mm. and you tell me what I need to be doing, right? So don't do that from now on. Don't. No. You know what okay. I mean? It's gonna be hard for you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Like I'm I blind. Think- like I, w- I woke up blind. I don't know what to do. <laughs> so just do. That's it. That's okay. it. Wait, this is you, right? I call you. <laughs> ring, ring, Kalila. 
Kalila? Yeah. I, I woke up and, I, you know, I opened my eyes, but then I was like, are they closed? Because I'm blind. I'm on my way. See, that's no, what I'm saying. No. Don't do that. Don't no, do that. No, no, yeah, you're, no, this yeah, no. You're, yeah, you're not supposed to. You fucking see? That's what I'm saying. You got to get trained. She did the fake scenario wrong. Yeah, you did the scenario wrong. Oh, this is practice? Yeah, you, no, yes. yeah, this is what I'm saying. Do you know, all right? going blind. It doesn't matter. You got to let it go, man. You got to really? go. You got to figure it out. Is blind maybe? Could she help with the Is that block? too much? That's a lot. Okay, that's something more, more. Um, it's blind too much. You yeah, got into um, someone uh, ran into your brand new Audi recently. No, I don't want to do that one because it's too real. Okay, but but, <laughs> but, the, but who did you call? You. And then. And Andrew. And then I immediately. Right. Fi- yeah. Got, yeah. But I have other. Uh, Andrew helped me, Santino. Right, okay. but you didn't have your insurance information. Right. So here, we, let's do something else. Okay. okay. This is good. Okay. Ring, ring. Um. Hey. Hey, Cookie Dough. See, don't do that. <laughs> so when you call me cookie well, dough, yeah. that means... But you call me cookie dough. I know. I know. <laughs> oh, that's true. Too? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, ring, ring. Hi, cookie, cookie dough. dough. <laughs> Hi, cookie dough. Hi, cookie Everything's dough. Everything's fine. Um, but, uh, you know, someone broke into the house last night. What? That's not good right now already. You're too invested. Uh, You're too what? invested. My cats are in there, too. They're all fine. Oh, that's they're my fine. second question. Are the cats fine? They're not alive, but they're fine. <laughs> <laughs> But they're fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? They're just, you know, I buried them already. Good. He, he did it by himself. He didn't ask you. I didn't ask for your favor. He did it himself. Yeah, I did it myself. I'm on my way. No, don't. Don't. Call. You can't oh, do my it. My cats are dead. But they already buried them. I already it's buried done. it. It's done. No, like I have. Move ex- on. I'm going to like exhume their bodies because I need to hold them one last time. Would you really? Yes. That's you kinda... can't do that to me. Uh, all right. All right. They're, uh, forget the cats. They're alive. <laughs> okay. All right. Are you okay? Are you hurt? No, it, no. Well, I, I don't. I mean, you know, just I'm not dying. Okay. Intruder came in. It was a MS-13. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That I knew that because that they, they had tattoos on their eyeballs. Oh. Yeah, yeah. And it was you know red. The, yeah. All their eyes were red. Yeah. I think they were on some sort of drug, right? And um, they had tattoos on their faces, and um, they had machetes and knives. Anyway, you know, they just started stabbing me. You know, me on my right leg. <laughs> okay. And I was like, please, senor, because I, you know, I don't want to, I just assumed they were Mexican. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Is, I don't know if that's, is that wrong? Uh, They're Salvadoran. Senor, senor, you know what I mean? Salvadoran. Yeah. And they go, puto, shut the fuck up. You know what I mean? <laughs> and then they fucking start stabbing me. Right? So I, I went to the hospital, right? But it's like, I'm, they're going to take my leg off. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I, I'm on my way. No, you can't Stop be on your way. way. <laughs> Stop saying you're on your you way. You can't be on the way. You can't be on the way. I, I, I you don't have know to support. What else to you say. have to support from a distance. I, okay. I'm, or I'm, let me ask you this scenario, right? <laughs> one of the guys you're seeing now, right? Oh God, he's okay. in one hospital. Oh God, don't do this. <laughs> Is that right? I'm in the other hospital. We have the same ailment. What's right, the ailment? Right, right leg stabbed by MS13. MS13 <laughs> stabbing to the leg. Right leg. Right leg. Right leg only. Right. Yeah. Right. We both. We all have MS13 knives sticking out of our legs. Yeah. Two different hospitals. <laughs> Two different hospitals. Right. <laughs> and you don't know the condition of either one of us. Right. So you have to race to one of the hospitals. Which one? Which one are you going to go to? You. See that you, you got to let that go. You got to go to the other guy. He did it. What? That was a great way. What? The Jedi mind trick. I just love what you just did. <laughs> what did I do? That what? was so good. What did I do? Wow, I just saw it all happen unfold my eyes. What? Because the whole time he was smiling, he knew your answer was going to be. But he I already to. knew your answer. Wow. You went to the party. You bought the ticket. You went to the gala. Non-refundable. And you bought the ticket. Non-refundable. Okay. I'm not, like, you can't, like, deprogram me, no. master. No, no, no. <laughs> Stuck for life. <laughs> undo, undo no. your work. You're my... Concubine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, then. Okay, well, here's the good news I wanted to share with you. Oh, that was great. That's just so stupid. So New York Times put out this article that basically says being short is better for the planet climate, and the climate. And you mm. should procreate like tall people like me and George um, and John Na. Gil, we don't know about you. Five nine, I'm short. Okay. Um, we should procreate with short people because you guys are inherent 
conservationists. If people were 10% shorter, we would save 87 million tons of food, a bajillion gallons of water, uh, because of, trash. Uh, because of consumption of less. the body, what the body can take? Um, yeah, you, less body to feed, less waste. Well, well, um, well, fuck it. Let's all be dwarves then. I mean, what the fuck are you talking about? Well, I think so. Yeah, yeah. Fuck so, a dwarf. And when you mate with a shorter person... Fuck a, let's do the campaign. Fuck a dwarf. Don't say that. Just say, fuck Brad Williams. <laughs> So no, we basically, when you when you mate with a shorter person, you're potentially saving the planet by wow. like shrinking the needs of subsequent generations. But all I'm saying is, you should put this new um, article on your dating app. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> oh, you think I should? I think so. That's funny. And you should not lie about your height. You I don't know? lie about the height. What okay. do you put? Height no, five three. That's not true. That's not what you put on Tinder. Would you put six? I two? remember. What did I put it? Five I, five. You put like five, five, yeah, five six or something. No, I didn't. I swear to God, I didn't. Maybe five five. It was like five 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 four. But yeah, yeah. Um, well, I'm the the only app I'm on now is Raya. I got banned from all the one, other right, ones. Right, right. So oh. you don't know what to do. I, I think I'm gonna get a new phone. I think, and you I'm gonna to. get. I'm gonna redo it. You have to. But with my real age this time. But I'm thinking now that like all of these girls who have like height requirements, who are like, I only want to date a guy who's like five ten and taller or six foot tall. Like they're they're not great conservationists like we should all be fucking short dudes short kings is yeah. the way to go yeah yeah i've always thought that and yeah. then you should be fucking four foot nine ting ting oh i should go lower yeah too. you keep going tall oh so you have to go lower as well oh i have to go that's, lower that's we need hard more of you that's hard why can i go my height yeah yes yeah yeah that's that's good i'll go my height <laughs> your height or i lower? can't go lower i've never had sex with anyone lower really no Ever? No, I, I just like you're not into, all of it on me. You well, know you're I mean? not into doggy then. What? You're not into doggy. I don't like doggy. I like looking at the face. You're so Good. Sweet. Yeah, yeah. I like looking in the eyes and seeing your suffering. <laughs> and your confusion. He's going, I got to see the confusion. And he goes, yeah, bye. Yeah, yeah. Concubine. concubine. You're my concubine, you know. Welcome to the party, baby. <laughs> yeah, right. The ticket. Yeah, my concubine. Yeah, here's yeah, yeah. A ticket. Like, yeah, here's a ticket. My dick's a ticket. <laughs> Yeah, but um, so you're you're the guys that you're seeing say that though. No, I just read the article. No, no, no the, the other Times. before though. Oh, oh, oh. So <coughs> basically, yes, it's very apparent that like if you call, I'm always picking up. If you text, like I'm always attending to you first. Like we're here in uh, we're here in Hawaii, say for instance. Like yeah. you're getting my master bedroom. I'm sleeping on the couch. Like you're always gonna be first. Like right, your right. comforts. Um, your needs are I am are come first, and I don't know how to uh, like release it from my brain. It's just habit at this point. I think I think it's just like habit that I need to break. Yeah, yeah. But I don't know. Well, you know, if it's but if it's causing you trouble in your relationships, then I, it's something we should address. All. Yeah, but that's on me. That's it not on, on you. you. Well, I do do the thing, you know, my mind. <laughs> so good at it. Yeah. I do I do my mental, mental games, you know. Yeah. But um, yeah, we'll see, you know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> so, Kalala, anyone that's been hitting up on Araya? Well, we were at dinner yesterday, and Bobby um, looked over at my phone, and he was like, "Who else? Who else do I have to start no, uh, a war with?" Uh, here's here's a new rule. What? Okay, so everyone, listen listen to me right now, okay? <laughs> My friends, <laughs> this is a message to my friends, okay? Y'all know, right, that Kalila and I dated for 10 years. Y'all know we work together. She's one of my best friends, I love her. And when she's on Raya and you like her shit, that means you're going behind my back and doing some shady shit. If you want to start a war with me, I'll fucking do the war, okay? I've been so nice to you over the years, dude. No, let's well, let's get real. Wow. I've been so fucking nice to you, bro. You know what I mean? I like you. You're my friend. But that shady shit. There's another one, too. Mm -hmm. He's much bigger than you. Mm -hmm. So I can't say his name. Mm -hmm. But if you're fucking listening to my friend, all right? We cool. We cool, but not. You know what I mean? Like I, I, I you know what I mean? There's another one, too, that's even bigger than what? that one, right? Right? There's another one that has a TV show right now. That guy, right? Huh? Okay. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's my point. You know what I mean? It's like, it's not, listen, 
There's a respect. There's a code. There's a, there's a code, code of conduct. It's just a conversation, too. That's all I, it is. You guys, and this is what I'll, I'll say to you guys. Um, I am his concubine. Yes. Say it to the camera, though. Which yeah. camera? I, I said it. Oh, he did? Okay, good. Yeah. You I'm, know, his, I'm, I'm your concubine. But I, I, you know, and this is what it is. I, they, people, peop, these comedians, right, think that I'm a pushover because I'm really nice. I'm a really nice guy at comedy clubs. I'm cool. You know what I mean? I, you know, I, um, I don't know. I, I just have this, I can exude an element of my personality, which is like this kind of, conf- like what my brother does, of this confused, naive, you know what I mean, guy that doesn't know what's going on. But uh, you have to, number one, I mean, I'm Korean, right? So I have a vindictiveness and I love revenge. And number two, if you get on my bad side, I will war and I, you know, I've been on w- in wars with people yeah. for over twenty years. You don't shy away. <laughs> I don't shy, shy away. away. I will fucking double down. I will. There's. I haven't played the La Jolla Comedy Store in almost twenty years because of one incident that happened there. Yeah. Wait, I'm what fucking, was the incident again? He, he wouldn't put me up. The fucking guy Ryan at the comedy. He's still there. He's still there. Yeah. He wouldn't put me up one night, and I go, if you don't put me up tonight, I'm never gonna play this room again. He goes, that's fine. So I go, and it's twenty years later, I'm stubborn as fuck. I won't play it. <laughs> and they've asked you. Yeah. Wow. I will not play it. Okay? So, what? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> right? Watch it, brother. Yeah, talented guy, though. But uh, it just, it's, you know, you know I, um, there's another comic in New York, you know, who's seeing um, this really hot girl. And I had dinner with her a couple nights in New York. But I, I, I told, my friends and people, I'm not gonna hook up with her and I'm not gonna try. But did you, why did you take her to dinner? She, um, she's cool. Oh, and I'm also she's bored. A friend. Yeah, it's a friend, right? I, trust me, I mean, she's so hot that I would. Yeah. If it, she wasn't this comic's ex girlfriend. You know what I mean? But I, it's a rule. I can't do it. But you still took her out to dinner, not to like be like, kind of check you real quick but you took her out to dinner and you acknowledge that she's very hot hot and that you would i would of if the scenario was different yeah but you still took her out on a date no i had dinner with a uh, with a comrade you could say how you could call it whatever it is yeah, but yeah. you still took the girl out did you pay or did you split the bill good okay <laughs> and did you say hey you want to hang and did you make reservations? Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> same thing. What if I don't have any intentions to fuck? That's the same thing. No, I don't think you have intentions to fuck because you already know she probably wouldn't. Exactly. Which makes me sad. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me really sad. Still, that took a turn. <laughs> We can have dinner. Yeah, you know, we can have dinner. You're, I would say, an <laughs> enigmatic leader. So mm. I cross the Kim line. Jong-il. I cross the line. Yeah, it's like your double standard is what it is. It's like, <laughs> okay, are, are they that this is a comics ex girlfriend? Uh huh. What's the difference, Bobby? I don't. You went. On, you went on a date. What's the difference if these guys just want to take me to dinner? Knowing that she won't fuck them, but they want to fuck you. That's the problem. But you already. But I. Okay. Same scenario. I okay. won't. Exactly. You're right. It's the same you thing. Su- <laughs> <laughs> it's the same thing. You're right. Sam, you got him to. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got me. You got me there. They got me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I think it is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, it's a different city. It's okay, Bobby. N- Thank you, there. George. And that story you told us that was so good. <laughs> <laughs> so riveting. But. <laughs> But, okay, uh, okay, a scenario. Yeah. If she were to say, hey, Bobby, can I go back to the hotel with you? I really want to suck your dick. Mm-hmm. Whoa, your head, oh. your head jolts no. up so fast, dude. <laughs> dude, what the fuck? But that's not because I do or don't. I'm playing Hogwarts. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, that's yeah. right now the okay, number one I'll priority. Switch, I'll switch it up. Hey, Bobby, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. you really, you want to come back to my place? I really want to suck your dick. No, I promise I'm playing, I, won't, I won't tell anybody. I, I'm going to tell you this, all right? I'm playing Hogwarts. Legacy. Hey, Bobby, I want you to come to my hotel. I want you to play Hogwarts Legacy while I suck your dick. My friend's going to play Hogwarts with me. 
and he happens to be stuck in my deck. No, no, no. That's just what she's saying. Oh, that, what, was, <laughs> I, oh, oh, I thought that you were, I was I thought you were playing you. <laughs> well, why did you say, why did you agree to that? <laughs> well, I, I agree to Gilbert. You agreed to me saying? stuck in I'd your... rather have you suck my deck when we play Hogwarts than have it. Yeah, yeah. All right, my bad. I, well, next time we do a character, change I the, voice. the voice. <laughs> yeah, well, you were so... your voice. You know, like, I'm like, oh, I Gilbert wants to I can't. My buddy Gilbert's going to suck my While I play Hogwarts. I thought about it. It's like, yeah, it's... Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My bad. Yeah, okay. Um, I think you're right, and I think... Um, you're a dirty scoundrel, just like all of them. Really? You think I'm a dirty scoundrel for that? Mm. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. You, you, what? You're crucifying people for doing something. All right, you let's back up. Okay. You're right. Let's. Can I back up now? Back Dude, do up, not baby. give me away either. Don't be like, you can have her. Don't say that, because... I, I was going to release you from the contract. I was going to give my contract. Okay. What? You want me to release you from the concubine con con contract? <laughs> I feel like this is like re reverse psychology. <laughs> I know. I wasn't. Uh, I, I saw him do it. He's doing it again. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. it's like what you already know. I want to be your concubine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. You can stay on. You, you can, can stay on for another whatever. All right. What? What? All right. Well, we want to wrap it up. Yeah. All right. Uh, this is not an unhelpful advice, but this is a clapback from the Slep Kingdom. This is from our buddy GF. He just wanted to let, this is based off our last episode, he just wanted to let Bobby know that there was a completely blind Asian person that won Master Chef, uh, Master Chef. And it should be noted, the guy who finished in second place lost to her. And I think he killed himself six months later. The episode where you said, you know... A blind photographer. If you're a blind photographer, is like, you're just... It's not a real thing. Yeah, it's not a real thing, or... But I already know his that's, argument. I already know his that's argument. That's the winner of MasterChef was a blind Vietnamese woman who, be, and Gordon Ramsay said it's the best food on the show. Yeah, uh, yeah unfortunately, can I say something to you? Mm -hmm. All right. Um, you know, his name is when you, when you eat food, you don't do it with your eyes. <laughs> now, if, now, if they she said, had, she had cut, if, no, no, if they said a, a woman that was born with no mouth, you know what I mean? One MasterChef. <laughs> One MasterChef, I'd be like, yeah, all right, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> He can't taste yeah. her food, right? <laughs> yeah, so that's completely, you know what I mean? Damn. I, I thought your okay. argument was going to be different. What do you think my argument was going to be? It's the same shit you hate in American Idol, where it's like, I think they're only pushing these contestants because they have the disability story. It does help. The story helps, but still, I'm pretty sure that if she came to my house, right? I mean, how would she do it, though? <laughs> We'd help her. <laughs> oh, we'd help her? Okay, also, good. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> There's ways they live in this I, world. I don't know how they, you know what I mean? Like, she's supposed to be at three, but it's like 4.30, right? She can't read her I walk. look outside, and she's like in the front, just walking in a circle. <laughs> I can't, dude. <laughs> oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, what's her name? Uh, let me see. I don't know what her name is. What? You look it up. Yeah. Well, forget it. The joke's over. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, it's too long. You are undefeated in this argument. Uh, Christina, uh, Christine Ha. Okay. Well, the joke's over. I couldn't, it's not. Well, let's try it. No, I, I, no, no, no <laughs> there's no way. It's always good. No, it's about me yelling at her to get in the house. Okay. Yeah. What would you say? Christine Ha, what the fuck are you doing? We're walking in circles. <laughs> why are you so mean to her? I don't know why. <laughs> Yeah. Why are you meet the blind person that's walking in a circle? He's about to cook you a meal. Well, she should have people, right? <laughs> Bro, blind people live by themselves. They do? Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. I don't, I don't know much. Do you think that they just like stay what? in a dark room walk until in someone like collects them? No, I've seen them like, you know, walk around and stuff with the stick. That's what she does. And that's yeah, how yeah. she walks around the kitchen. She does have to ask people, though, am I holding... She does do this in the show. Am I holding a pepper? Am I holding a potato? Mm. Stuff like that. Can she I ask you another question, though? Yeah. When a blind person... <laughs> let me <Last> see. <laughs> I just, when a blind person is living by themselves, right? They, you know, make, like, interior design goes out the window, right? They don't care about the... They, they don't care about wallpaper or, like, you know what I mean, the photographs of the wall, right? It's just, like, minimalist. Yeah. Like bad, you know what I mean? Probably more feel, right? Like I want a nice couch. A very nice Or, you know what, they could like those kind of walls that you like with the panels. They like texture on their walls. So they could be like, oh, can I get, you know, those. We, like we like have the green in, room. Like, yeah. yeah, the green room. The downstairs, the green room. Oh, so you have. 
textured, more well, textured. Well, I'll do, I, I'll do something even better. Put Braille on the wall. For what? <laughs> How about Braille, Braille wallpaper? But what does it say? It has to say oh, it something. Describes it could read a book or whatever, you know what I mean? Oh. <laughs> You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, this you know, this book is the sun also rises or whatever. But you're just, yeah. You know what I mean? Hemingway. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. This other one is the Bible. Yeah. You know yeah. What I mean? Wait, who is um? I think we should have a, a blind guest next. Oh, for sure. Because I don't ba- know, uh, Bobby has beef with a blind. I don't have a blind. <laughs> I don't have beef with no blind. Let's bring Christine Ha. Oh yeah. With her? Yeah, the winner master chef. No. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> Because they'll have to bring it up. It's uncomfortable. <laughs> what? Because I, I I I do these as jokes. I know they live good. <laughs> <laughs> they live. They know how to do it. They live good. They have good, beautiful houses. Everything. You know what I mean? Uh, They're just jokes, man. Yeah. You know. Interesting. The blind. <laughs> Yesterday we were at dinner. Um, we were talking about whether or not Amber Heard's baby is Elon Musk's mm. um, yeah, yeah. spawn, right? And then you said that if you were to see Amber Heard on Raya, that you would, you wouldn't swipe right. I don't find her attractive. Not even for the well, story. Not, a little, not even a little bit. You don't no. think she's hot? She's a very hot. No, she's. Oh, I mean, she's. I think because of the craziness, I don't like crazy. You don't. I can't deal with no. I can't deal with like that kind of crazy. Oh, like litigation on TV. Crazy. Yeah, I just I. I don't know anything about the poo, but it's like I don't want any poo involved. Wait, you love poo? Yeah, I like poo, but my poo isn't purpose. It's accidental poo. Not rage poo. Yeah, it's not poo for, as a weapon or a tool. Not for right? bad. It's like I shit my pants. It's, it's poo's for good, not for bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's bad for me when I had to clean it. Well, that's another thing. Don't clean it next time. And that, yeah. I know. I hired Jenna. Really? Yeah, she's been cleaning your poo for five years. <laughs> yeah, but I, I, I don't find her attractive, Amber Heard. Yeah. Okay, so it's a definite no you, Gilbert? No. It, now you you're married, me. but you also. No, but he even was if I was hypothetical. I think you did. No, I would. You would. I would. I like would a one night stand. Yeah, one I'd night. fuck anything. I'll uh, fuck one, her one night. Yeah. One yeah, night. George Kimmel. Oh yeah. One night yeah. stand. Yeah, John Nah. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Johnny Depp stayed with her after she was crazy for a long time. There's got to be something there. The good. You know what it is. Mm. <laughs> no, I, I. Can I make an mm. argument though? She could be fun. There's, you know. When you're a celebrity like Johnny Depp and a sex symbol, right? Eventually, you can get anything you want, right? So then, you, I think you look for the other complexities and craziness, mm-hmm. right? It's like imagine being able to fuck anybody you want at any time, anywhere in the world, and he's been able to do that since his early twenties or whatever, right? By the time you're fifty, it's like, yeah, I'll, I suck frog dick. <laughs> You know what I mean? It's the only thing that turns me on, bitches. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I fuck a llama f- frog. You know what I mean? I, I, like <laughs> you, you go, to, you go into bestiality, whatever. You know what I mean? You get bored. Like, you get like, bored. Ar- like Army Hammer. Yeah. He got bored. He's, yeah, he went into hot like, white guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's my point. And stuff. Yeah, it's. Just, I'm gl- glad. You know what I mean? I was born the way I am. It's a challenge still. And it's a miracle when I get it. That's a good point for us. It's a miracle when I get it. Normal sex is still amazing. It's still amazing. I don't want it ever to be a complex uh, well, thing. Well, this is the reason why I don't use sex toys. I haven't been watching porn. It's because I don't want to keep upping my requirement to come. So it's like, I want missionary to always get me there. I want a simple, you know... Um, uh, you know, masturbation sesh to always get me there. If I start adding these things, I'm afraid that like I'll always want these things. Okay. Mm. So it's like keep just I'm fine with the basics. Anyway, so what did we learn today? A lot. A lot. So much. Anyway, thank you for listening. <laughs> also, where are we recording from? We're in Hawaii. There we go. <laughs> What's up, Slept Kingdom? I hope you enjoyed the podcast. A little bit of self-plug for your boy, Flat Flat, a.k.a. me, Gilbert. I just launched a brand new martial arts, MMA, combat sports, action cinema channel here on YouTube. If you're into that kind of stuff, please check out the link down below in the description. Our first video is a little fun mashup of taking the Arthur meme and turning it into an anime. Once again, that's a link in the description for Ost Media. Shukuruki.